So Monday I wake up and I swim for about half an hour and I'll have a quick shower at Chermside and I'll head off to uni and then I'll go home and do some assignments and then go back to swimming training for night time from 6 till 7. At first I struggled getting up at 5 o'clock in the morning to leave to get to Chermside for training but I just got used to it. Getting into uni was a struggle at first, like just adjusting to the life, like a um, uni student life, and like with the presentations for the lecture notes, um, as I can't write down fast as everyone else because I can't move my eyeballs, so I have to move my head up and down or left to right with my eyesight and like seeing the lectures, um, the lecture notes on the board and. So my lectures are always, lecturers are always willing to give me the notes before and always check up on me if I need help with my assignments or anything. Two weeks ago I got my results back for my oral presentation and I got a high distinction and that's really good for me for um, a group assignment as well as an oral presentation because I always get nervous when speaking to others. And when I got the score back, I'm like, it can't be right. And then I went and looked at the criteria sheet and you could just see the high distinction. And I'm like, then I yelled out to mum and was like, mum, I got a high distinction. Yeah. Um, so inclusion diversity means to me is that everyone can be involved, no matter what race or disability they have. So long as they can compete or join in with anything. Um, you've got to take hold of opportunities that you get given or even if you see them you should take opportunity to grab them while they're there because you don't know what's going to happen in the future. Just to be yourself and just get out there and give it a shot. It doesn't matter if you come last in a race or anything but as long as you gave it your best it's all that counts.